Do do. So wait, what am I missing for memories now? What's the last few? Um. Oh, the set isn't saving. Okay. What's this? Oh, those are scholars. Okay. Only three. Oh, we can go get the last citizens. We can go. We can go save them. It's not like I'm a completionist or anything. I mean, what? <laughs> There's side objectives I didn't do yet, and I'm right there. Oh, well, let's go do them. Nope, no, L type. Thank you. You need something? Goodbye. Yeah, you'll you'll have my head. Blah blah blah. You know what? Funny about those threats—they never follow through. Oh no 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 no! Ow, asshole! Whoa, she just looks... You look like you got the plague, woman. I don't mean to offend, I really don't, but you just looked like you had the plague. Or the Joker got a hold of you. Nope, can't go that way. Flag. Yes, yes. Why not both? Well, all the above, I guess. Come on, just climb on down. They'll never notice and be suspicious of me. Oh, you ruined it! You ruined my sneaky stabby stab. Good. Just don't worry about it. Just don't let it happen again. Come on. There we go. Hi, guys. No one saw anything. There is no war in Bossing Say. There is no war in Bossing Say. There are no assassins in Damas. There are no assassins in Damas. Son of a bitch. No shit, I'm exposed. Ow. That's everybody. Go, go, go. Escape. I didn't kill anyone. You saw nothing. No, no, no. I'm not a murderer. I'm a hero. I saved that poor woman. Shush. I didn't do anything. 
How dare they accuse me of murder? That's a, that's a heinous crime. I abhor that. I, Altair, would never condone such horrible crimes like murder. Unaliving people, though, you know, I'm okay with. Kill is such a strong word. What was it about not being allowed up here? Whoa! Oh, so I can break pots and be a nuisance just not there? Okay. Wait, what? Oh, okay. Come on. Problem. We get all the we saved everybody. Nice. Now Now for the target. Whoa. Whoops. That was a bit unnecessary. No, I won't. <laughs> I pay for nothing. For I don't have to deal with consequences of my actions. I'm like, where the hell? We need more time. This is the excuse of a lazy or incompetent man. Which are you? Neither. What I see says otherwise. Now, tell me, what do you intend to do to solve this problem of ours? These weapons are needed now. I see no solution. The men work day and night, but your client requires so much, and the destination, it is a difficult route. Were it that you could produce weapons with the same thing <sighs> as you produce excuses? I have done all I can. It is not enough. Then perhaps you ask too much. Too much? I gave you everything. Without me, you would still be charming serpents for coin. All I ask in the return was you fill the orders I bring you. And you say I ask too much? Please, Tamir. I meant no insult. There you go. Ho! Oh. Stop! Stop! <laughs> I'm just getting started. Oh, oh shit. You came into my soup, stood before my men, and dared to insult me! <laughs> Fun. Let me pass, let me pass. Oh shit! Let this be a lesson for the rest of you. Think it twice before you tell me something cannot be done. Get back to work. I forgot how brutal that guy is. Stop. Go away. Leave me alone. Did you 
Go away, you beggar. Poor beggar. Gotcha. You'll pay for this. No, I won't. You and all your kind. It seems you're the one pays now, my friend. You'll not profit from suffering any longer. You think me some petty death dealer, suckling at the breast of war? No. Yes. Strange target, don't you think? Why me, when so many others do the same? You believe yourself different, then? Oh, but I am. For I serve a far nobler cause than mere profit. Who are you serving? My brothers. Brothers? Ah, but he thinks I am the man. I am but a piece. A man with a part to play. Okay. You'll come to know the others soon enough. They won't take kindly to what you've done. Good. I look forward to ending their lives as well. Such pride. It will destroy you, child. Um, so yeah, that happened. Now let's get the fuck out of here. Can't catch me! She's gotta find a spot to hide. Spot. We gotta find a spot. Fuck. There we go. Come on, come on, come on. Hurry, hurry, hurry. Jump in, jump in, jump in. Anything. Nope, just gonna keep running. Come on. There we go. There we go. the thing. Keep going. You can climb. There we go. Word has reached me of your victory, Altair. You have my gratitude and my respect. Thanks. Thank you. It is a shame that the other assassins continue to hold you in such poor regard. Rafiq, I do not care what the others think of me. Not. As you wish, Altair. You should make news of your victory to Al Malik. I'm certain he has more work for you to do. Fast forwarding memory to a more recent one. <coughs> Nice. So wait, what did I not get? Oops. Memory log, what am I... Investigation? Oh, I didn't wait. Oh. Is that because I just, you know... 
Oh, and I'm pulled out. Out of the machine, Mr. Miles. What's the matter, Doc? Miss Stillman is once again insisting I let you rest. Okay. <coughs> Bye, angry old bald man. Hmm. Lucy. Do, do, do. You said wind up like early. What did you mean? Nothing back to work, please. We have a d deadline. P.S. Why do you sign your emails? It says right on top who's coming from. So, do you like telling me who put the stick up his ass? We have a deadline. One week. Well, six days now. Deadline? I can't talk about it. Man, put yourself in my shoes. I'm being held hostage by a group of scientists, at least I think you're scientists, and forced to spend all day in some crazy-ass machine. You won't tell me what you're looking for or why you want it, but I'm supposed to be thanking you for keeping me alive. This is so fucked. Yeah, it is. Sorry, but it is. What do you want me to do? Hmm, let's see. I don't know. Maybe give me some answers? I can't. And it's better this way. Safer. Safer for who? Both of us. Yeah. Hey, you know what? I've got a question I think you can actually answer. What's up? Why is it that sometimes the guys in there talk like they're from the future? The future? Yeah, I mean the present. Now, today, whatever. You've probably noticed that English has become the official language of the Holy Land. Yeah, I was gonna say. The Animus is translating speech it deems vital into more modern English. So expect a few anachronisms. I could probably make it more authentic, but you ever read Chaucer? Who? Yeah, definitely not for you. What's that supposed to mean? Can you tell me more about Abstergo? Or what goes on here? Beyond the whole keeping me prisoner thing. Abstergo is one of the largest pharmaceutical companies in the world. Their primary focus is antidepressants. There's some information on the computer over there. But you already said this isn't about testing a drug. So what's the deal? I don't like where this is going. So it's safe to assume the Animus is not a part of their public face. What, you haven't seen the commercials? Oh my god. She has a sense of humor. I'm sorry, Desmond. I've got a lot of work to do. Like I said, if you want to know more about the company, take a look at the computer. The telecommunication stuff is particularly interesting. Oh. As a general reminder, all employees of Abstergo Industries are prohibited from discussing corporate policy proceedings and projects. In light of pending litigation, you are all reminded of Sections 2.15 of your employment contracts. <sighs> you acknowledge and agree that Abstergo has developed such confidential information by investment of significant time, effort, and expense, and that such confidential information provides Abstergo with a significant competitive advantage in its business. You acknowledge and agree that a breach of of this agreement by you will therefore result in irreparable harm to Abstergo, blah, 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 the extent of which can be difficult to ascertain, and in any event, money damages will be inadequate as a remedy in the event of such a breach. Accordingly, you agree that in the event of a breach of this agreement by you, Abstergo shall in be entitled to injunctive or otherwise equitable relief as, to, as the court deems appropriate, in addition to any other remedies of which it may have available. That's kind of ominous. Should you have any questions, please do not hesitate to contact your human resources manager. We thank you in advance for your compliance. Because that's not at all like pretty much either you do as we tell you or not only will we sue you, but we'll find a way to make it look like you didn't work here. Because you're dead. Because we're a pharmaceutical company. That's what we do to you. We kill you with antidepressants. Will make you so antidepressed you're dead. Yep, locking me in. Of course. Assholes. Man, I can't even change my clothes. <laughs> I don't know, the whole the white 
hoodie and faded jeans thing works for you, Desmond. Really? Is he wearing white shoes? Whatever. Let's go. Oh, can't do it yet. Fine. Oh, they're just gray shoes, okay. Whoa! 